Good morning everyone. Welcome to my kitchen. Thank you for watching my other videos. Um, so today I'm going to show you fish curry, the Kerala fish curry, typical uh, Nadan mean curry. You can use any kind of fish for that, but for this one, I'm going to use kingfish. So, uh, kingfish like we get it at Indian store mostly. Um, so they cut it into round pieces, they slice it and give it. So normally we just have to de-skin it. Uh, that is small pieces akita. Since it's frozen, one tip I have to give you: you have to uh, salt, put some, apply some salt, and uh, leave it for a couple of hours for thawing. Alangila mingar ingre atrem pidi ke thella. So nalla itapada uppa ka periti vechure couple of hours it has to rest. Adigarinita then we'll do the process. So I already have the fish outside because it was frozen, like I said. So I'm going to remove the skin, cut it into small pieces, uh, and then namala uppa perti adu vekka. Uppa perti vechitta. Then after maybe an hour, because it was already out for an hour or so now. So um, after putting the the you know applying the salt, um, we'll wait for maybe an hour and then we'll make the masala. It's very simple fish curry, but it's very tasty. Um, and it can stay for over a week if you if you refrigerate it at the right time. Um, so let's start with the fish curry. Let me clean the fish first. So in the mean candle, they are like big uh, big pieces. Um, it's frozen, Anna. So I weighed it. It was almost um, uh, almost five pounds. It's around a little less than two kgs. Ro onne mukal onne mukal kilo onda. Panna makadende toli ekka karanjita slice ya dene. So, we will So, small, small slices I always cut out this you can see I am not taking the the, the bone so apple can delay around uh, 35 to 40 pieces on the uh, around uh, four four pounds it's around 4 pounds. So, 35 pieces, big pieces. So, the next step, the, like I said, it was frozen. So, we'll sprinkle some salt. Uh, so, what are the ingredients? Ingredients are no kambone. So there are two ways you can do it. One with a little bit of onion um, uh, and one without onion. So I'm not going to add any onions at all. onions like it's small onion, the shallots, cherry uh, So I'm not going to use that because I'm only using um, ginger garlic paste. So ginger garlic paste for that around that uh, 35 pieces of fish, I'm using almost three tablespoons of ginger garlic paste. All together, it's almost um, three and a half, three three and a half tablespoon of ginger garlic paste. It's uh, the ginger garlic paste. Uh, when I make it, I put equal amounts of ginger and garlic. I grind it, 
uh, then I, you know, our paste, um, I just uh, freeze it. So I then freeze it in the which I can So it's almost three and a half, three, three and a half tablespoon of ginger garlic paste. Pinne, when the uh, again, I am not going to use spicy chili powder. I'm only using Kashmiri chili. So the other area is so it's not spicy at all. But the good thing using the, the Kashmiri chili is you get very thick curry. Um, so you can add as much as you want, but I am using almost seven tablespoons of Kashmiri chili powder. Pinne or almost one tablespoon um, turmeric powder. Pin or lather. Puli, mean puli, and the barem, Namada Natla, Kudambuli and the barem, Thotpuli and the barem, Ivide, Kokum, the Varanya, Kokum. In the Indian store, you can find it now. Either Nyan Nati in the Wonder the Puliana, so Kokum, Thotpuli. I cannot give a measurement for this puli. Either Namal Chaid Jaida, Namada taste and answer, you need to learn to adjust the, uh, the puli. Uh, so, Panyanipum, Nyanuri, five, six pieces in Yanate. Almost to six pieces of yani paid the tender. Adin yani na salt. Uh, it's a, I added some water and salt. Uh, but in the tidi binna yani I just directly add it to the fish curry. So either this is the main ingredient that gives the taste uh, for the fish curry. Namada naatle naadan mean curry de two main mean puli yana. So nalla puli yandengile. It's always good. But shippam I always see Indian store has kokum. Um, I think it's coming from Sri Lanka or something. So you get this puli now here. Upon totally um, Kashmiri chili powder, uh, eri lata molokudi, pinna mate main ingredient and the curry leaf. Nay, would a nipum parcheda. So it's curry leaves, turmeric powder, ginger garlic paste. And the other method I always use is um, some people directly, oh, pinna undakuna southern kanande chatti. So nyan in the mean chatti lana mean curry undakam bone. I'm just going to mix this now, the turmeric and um, this so but the way I do is I separately saute this little bit and fried aroma when that comes uh, you can feel it like small flame in small flame you um, roast this chili powder roast it you will once that nice aroma comes out uh, you turn off the flame add water and then just uh, you know just maybe one or or pulse you can grind it so it make, becomes a nice thick paste so I, I also notice that that makes the curry like really thick so when I when I you know these are tips that I use because a lot of people a lot of people including my grandmother who is not alive anymore um, you know uh, said she heard from many people who came and ate my food said my fish curry is one of the best so Nyan I'm giving you the tips that you know the way I, I make the fish curry. So, we uh, have to it separate and roast it and grind it. Paste it grind it. It's already very fine powder, so you don't need to grind it too much. You know, but I notice this gives more thickness to the curry. Uh, so, that is pretty much it. So, you can roast it roast it. Uh, so you can all the, the coconut oil always makes the fish curry really tasty so I'm just warming up the oil uh, that I'm going to roast the the turmeric and the chili powder so the yan I do go on so the small flame alone roast it in the so dry roast this this makes the I mean uh, like I said you can directly add um, this chili powder and turmeric powder to the ginger garlic you know uh, mix directly but I noticed this makes the curry even more tastier and more thicker You will smell the, the the aroma of the you know the chili powder. So once you feel that, you can turn off the flame and always make sure it's on low flame. Uh, so I think 
for within 3-4 minutes. I can already smell it now. So, so I took some water. So I'm just going to turned off the flame uh, so you can see this is like a paste now so I'll add a little bit more water when I grind it I'm a grinder then we'll add this directly to the sorted ginger garlic mix so ready so next thing fish wash so let's I'm going to clean the fish now so one other tip with the, you know, with the cleaning of the fish, when you um, wash, when you wash the fish, uh, I remember lemon, fish I feel like it adds more flavor. flavor. Naring at a near last round, Yan Naring a Pirin Uricha, Adilan Yan Kadigadukum. Pinna Naring at a Thota Kanamata Kaigadi and up of him into Manoka Nanita, poem singing at the Nanangilum. So upon other Uru Uru Tipana, Naringa, you say the Naringa illingly. If you don't have the lemon, you can use vinegar too. So vinegar is also a good, uh, you know, good thing to clean the fish. So upon Let's let's clean the fish. The fish is ready. It's all cleaned. Uh, it's ready to cook now. Then the next thing, Namaka, uh, I need to make grind this. It's nothing major. Just to do quick grinder let on the karaki. Then it will be ready to go. So, apa the Namaka? Just on the grind it. So let's start our process now. So like I said earlier, fish curry is always good with coconut uh, oil. So I am going to use coconut oil to make this fish curry. And leave it because it's so cold here. I think in a harder time. So I put around 3 tablespoon of um, coconut oil. Again I forgot to mention one ingredient uh, that is Uluwa Pudi, uh, fenugreek. See that pudding in it, I always have it next to me so I sprinkle it in the end so I keep forgetting to mention it. But you have to have uh, some fenugreek powder to Ulua. So I'm adding some mustard. So for Kadiga, the mustard is all fluttering. So I need a ginger garlic paste idea. So when you add the ginger garlic paste, always lower the flame because you know that it's uh, well up in the <coughs> and it has a little bit of water content. Just be careful. Then uh, if you're adding onions or sh uh, chopped shallot, <coughs> you can add that to uh, with this ginger garlic onion, ginger garlic paste. So now saute this until it turns almost brown. it nicely you can add some curry leaves now and you can add the rest later so it's almost brown so it's almost brown I can smell it nicely so next step is we'll add the um, chili paste So 
സോ അപ്പം രണ്ട് രീതി ചെയ്യാം വേണേൽ നേരെ മുളക് പൊടി ഇങ്ങോട്ട് ചേർക്കാം അല്ലെങ്കിൽ ഞാൻ ചെയ്തതുപോലെ ഡ്രൈ റോസ്റ്റ് ചെയ്തിട്ട് ഒന്നരച്ച് ഇങ്ങനെ ചേർക്കുക അപ്പം ചാറിന് നല്ല തിക്നെസ് കാണാം നിങ്ങളുടെ അവരവരുടെ ഇഷ്ടത്തിന് ടേസ്റ്റ് അനുസരിച്ച് സോൾട്ട് ലാസ്റ്റ് ഫ്യൂ കറി ലീവ്സ് സോ നൗ ദ മേജർ സ്റ്റെപ്പ് വിൽ ആഡ് ദ ഫിഷ് ഞാൻ പറഞ്ഞില്ല നിങ്ങൾ ഇഫ് യു ആർ ആഡിങ് ലിറ്റിൽ ബിറ്റ് ഓഫ് ഒനിയൻ ഉള്ളി ഇച്ചിരി ഉള്ളി ഇച്ചിരി ചേർക്കുവാണെങ്കിൽ യു ക്യാൻ ആഡ് ദാറ്റ് പക്ഷെ ഞാൻ ഇപ്പം ജിഞ്ചർ ഗാർലിക് പേസ്റ്റ് മാത്രം ആണ് യൂസ് ചെയ്തത് ചില്ലി പൗഡർ അഗെയിൻ ഐ യൂസ്ഡ് ഓൾമോസ്റ്റ് സെവൻ സെവൻ ഓർ എയ്റ്റ് ടേബിൾ സ്പൂൺ ബിക്കോസ് ഇറ്റ്സ് എരി ഇല്ലാത്ത ഇറ്റ്സ് എ കാശ്മീരി ചില്ലി പൗഡർ ഇറ്റ്സ് നോട്ട് ദാറ്റ് സ്പൈസി ബട്ട് ഇഫ് യു ആർ യൂസ് ആഡിങ് സ്പൈസി ചില്ലി പൗഡർ യു ആർ ജസ്റ്റ് യുവർ സ്പൈസ് ലെവൽ അക്കോർഡിംഗ്ലി നമ്മൾ നല്ലതായിട്ട് മിക്സ് ചെയ്തു ജസ്റ്റ് ക്ലോസ് ദിസ് ആൻഡ് വൺസ് ഇറ്റ് ബോയിൽസ് വിൽ ലോവർ ദ ഫ്ലെയിം ആൻഡ് ദെൻ കുക്ക് ഫോർ അനദർ തേർട്ടി ടു ഫോർട്ടി ഫൈവ് മിനിറ്റ്സ് ഇൻ ലോ ഫ്ലെയിം ദെൻ അത് യു നോ വി ഹാവ് ടു ലീവ് ഇറ്റ് ഓപ്പ് ആൻഡ് ഷോ യു ദാറ്റ് സോ റൈറ്റ് നൗ ഇറ്റ്സ് ഓൺ ഹൈ ഫ്ലെയിം ഇറ്റ് ഹാസ് ടു ബോയിൽ ആൻഡ് ദെൻ വിൽ ഡബിൾ ചെക്ക് ആഫ്റ്റർ ദാറ്റ് അപ്പോൾ നമുക്കിത് തിളച്ചോ നോക്കാം Yep, so you can see it's uh, boiling now. So in this way, we'll close it, we'll lower the flame and let it cook on low flame for at least 30 minutes. So it's almost uh, 45 minutes, I can you. So the talacha, nalla, yen puli ekka nokki, it has nalla puli under. And a pretty fish curry, it's always... when it's hot you you know you should taste it a little extra puli nallayittu thonanam illengil when it sits for a day or something you know you probably will have to add more more puli appa aa endu varane puli eppozhum munbotta irikkanam fish curry ku nammal choododa undaakumbodu so idu pa correct aanu ini idu it's when it sits for a day it will be perfect അപ്പം ഇത് ഓൾമോസ്റ്റ് റെഡിയായി ഞാനപ്പം ഐ എം ആഡിങ് ദ ഉലുവ പൊടി ഫെനു ഗ്രീക്ക് സോ ഓൾമോസ്റ്റ് ഹാഫ് എ ടീസ്പൂൺ സോ ഐ ആഡ് ദാറ്റ് ഐ ലോവർ ദ ഫ്ലെയിം ആൻഡ് ലീവ് ഇറ്റ് ഓപ്പൺ ഫോർ മേ ബി അനദർ ടെൻ ഫിഫ്റ്റീൻ മിനിറ്റ്സ് ബിക്കോസ് അതിൻ്റെ ദൻ യു വിൽ സി ദ ഓയിൽ കംസ് ഓൺ ടോപ്പ് അപ്പോഴാണത് നല്ലതായിട്ട് റെഡിയാകുന്നത് സോ ഓയിൽ മേളി തെളിയണം സോ ദാറ്റ്സ് ദാറ്റ്സ് വെയ്റ്റ് ഫോർ ദാറ്റ് സോ കണ്ടില്ലേ ഓയിൽ ഇങ്ങനെ മുകളില് കാണാൻ തുടങ്ങി സി ഓയിൽ എണ്ണ തെളിയുവാന്ന് പറയാ അതിന് സോ ഓയിൽ ഹാസ് ടു കം ടു ദിറ്റ് ഹാസ് ടു കം ലിൽ ബിറ്റ് മോർ ആൻഡ് ദെൻ ഇറ്റ് വിൽ ബി റെഡി സോ അപ്പം സി ലുക്ക് ഓയിൽ എങ്ങനെ സൈഡിലെല്ലാം ലൈക്ക് യു ക്യാൻ സി ഇറ്റ്സ് കവർ സ്ലോലി കവറിങ് വിത്ത് ഓയിൽ തിങ്ക് ഇറ്റ്സ് ഇറ്റ്സ് റെഡി സോ ഐ എം ഗോയിൻ ടു ടേൺ ഇറ്റ് ഓഫ് ആൻഡ് ലീവ് ഇറ്റ് ഓപ്പൺ ഫോർ സം മോർ ടൈം സോ i have i feel like it's i have enough curry uh, it's thickened um so it's all ready so i'm going to turn it off but just wanted to show you clearly see oil you can see see that see yep so see it's all ready all set ready to go king fish so a couple of things to keep in mind uh, if because it's kingfish it took almost an hour 
Pashaipam, if you're using tilapia or salmon, that, you know, they cook very fast. So salmon, I think you can have the fish curry ready in maybe 30 minutes because it cooks very fast. Same with tilapia. So kingfish, it should have some edukum, so that's why it took longer. And always, um, fish curry always tastes better when you cook it in on low flame. So once it boils, always lower the flame, cook it on low flame. Always cook it on low flame. Uh, leave it for at least 12 hours outside upon fish fish curry taste way better if you have guests and all coming this is something you can prepare early and keep upon so jolly or three or any game so apple Kerala Nadan fish curry on that come in a letter on that can enjoy it so thank you for watching till next time bye bye